the Reuben, hot pastrami on rye, the muffaletta, the Philly cheesesteak. Oh, what sandwiches have come to find a home throughout various parts of the U.S. and we're all the better for it. Today, I'm going to share a recipe for a sandwich that is the darling of the state of Florida. This sandwich is undoubtedly and unanimously known as the Cubano or Cuban sandwich. The Cubano is a variation of ham and cheese sandwich that likely originated in cafes catering to Cuban workers in Tampa or Key West. Two early Cuban immigrant communities in Florida centered around the cigar industry. Later on, Cuban exiles and expats brought it to Miami, where it is also very popular. The Cubano starts with a classic Cuban sub-style bread, roasted pork shoulder, ham, Swiss cheese, pickles, mustard, and a classy mojo sauce. The meat. We start with a 10 pound pork butt or shoulder. The marinade. We will marinate in a refrigerator for at least 12 hours. Follow the recipe on the screen. I left mine overnight. The cook. We will roast in a baking pan with a cooling rack at 275 until we reach an internal temperature of 150 degrees Fahrenheit. The mojo. While you're roasting, it's time to make the classy mojo sauce. We'll start with five cloves of garlic, quarter cup fresh parsley, half cup lime juice, half teaspoon coarse black pepper, half teaspoon kosher salt, two thirds cup fresh orange juice, three tablespoons extra virgin olive oil, and a half cup white onion. Now blend them all together until you reach a thin, saucy consistency. When your pork shoulder is ready, you are in for a treat. I had to fight off the urge to make some carnitas tacos, but we'll have to save that for another video. Time for the setup. I wasn't able to find Cuban bread in my area, so I just used the softest sub-style bread I could find. Slice your bread in half and butter both sides. Include the outsides as well. Place your bread on a skillet, comal, plancha, or your heavyweight boxing champ grill. Once your bread starts getting toasty, safely take it out and start with a mustard on one side. Next, Swiss cheese. Chop up some roasted pork chunks and line the whole thing. Two slices of ham, pickles, and a couple of teaspoons of your mojo sauce. Now close it up and place it back on your grill. Until your cheese melts and you get that toasty feeling.
Now cut your Cubano in half on a long bias. This will ensure you get the full flavor experience in every bite. And there you have it. Your Cubano sandwich is complete. Now all you have to do is enjoy. Thank you for watching. I'm Steve Lopez, sharing some home cooked goodness just for you. If you like what you're seeing, would you please consider supporting us by subscribing to my channel? Thank you. Before we go, I'd like to say hello to Cynthia from Texas, Freddie from Pennsylvania, Esther from Texas, Gabrielle from Texas, and Donnie from Romular High School says, I like your cooking channel, you just need more cowbell. Well, this is for you, Donnie. Once again, I'm Steve Lopez. God bless you and be safe.